know, and again, this is Southwestern contract, uh, and again, salary scale, so I can't I didn't delve into their rationale, but. And it wasn't a bid or anything like that. Yeah. On the organizational chart, um, with Mr. Limble uh, changing his position, is his position identified here specifically? No. Are you? Yeah. Is it a special project director? I had a question mark by that because I didn't know whether we were going to try to. That that has be a ladder. We, we, are, are, we are filling that position. Mr. Linda's position. Right. Uh, he has many hats that he wears. He's like an assessment director, uh, gear up. He has all kinds of things. So, uh, acuity, writing, what you call West Virginia writing now, I think it's called. So, we will, we, we will post his position. So, are you going, uh, is his position going to have the same duties it has now? Or are you Correct. About, you want to continue with just the there same There may duties? be some tweaking going on with okay. the job description, but the posting will be the same. But uh, you right. may mod modify the duties a little bit? Just a head. Yes. Okay. And the funding source is county, or are some of those other I think funds it's, I, in there? I think it's county. Okay. Mm -hmm. The person that comes in the position, Assistance. Yes, sir. And by the way, just for the board's, I guess, notification, Mr. Uh, Doug Smith is now as a consultant. He started as his consultant. Remember, I had him on sub mm -hmm. because he could have authority. He switched and he is on now as a consultant when used. Does anyone else have any, any further questions regarding the administrative part or any administrative item? If not, I make a motion to uh, accept the administrative items. Second. Motion's been made and seconded. Is there any is there any questions? All those in favor? Aye. Uh, all opposed? The ayes have it. Let's move to the finance. Um, since Ms. Gandy isn't here. I emailed the board I understand and asked them. Um, I don't have any in discussion over the invoices, although we have them if there is a question. Um, but Ms. Candy was uh, not here tonight. As far as the, uh, that's A. You want to go on? Uh, I'd like to go to B. Well, I'm go sorry. ahead. Sorry, A. I'm going to have to recuse myself from page one for branch from the PSD forty nine dollars and eighty one cents. Forty one dollars? No. Uh, forty nine dollars. Forty nine eighty one. That's branch on PSD. Yeah. I had to repeat myself. It's okay. Um well, let's go uh, before we go any, I mean we can just go ahead and go through the items and then sure. we'll go ahead and sure. do that in, in a second. The B, the purchase of two uh, Kubota mo uh, model diesel commercial mowers from Stratton Tractor Sales. And one, mo mo one mower is for the school grounds and one is for the Hammond Lines Field. Um, I, I, have a, I have a quick question to handle mm -hmm. their own entity. Am I correct? Correct. So why would we be buying a, why, why would we purchase a mower? We actually give them money over here, if I'm correct. Correct. Uh, my understanding from past practice, we, we purchased the mower they had, and in return, you may ask, what do we get? Oh, yes. I think is a legitimate question. One, we can use it any time, but mainly the, uh, the cut, um, the handling, school, and anything at the high school to help um, with cutting the high school fields. That's all I can tell you. The high school fields at the at Lincoln County High School? Yes, sir. Okay. That, that, that when needed, they would they would be have to do that. A lot of coaches do it themselves. But that was uh, all I can add to that. Well, yeah. it's used at Hamilton Middle School to cut the grass. Correct. Yes. Yeah. Who will operate this? This, this mower will be transferred over, however, how we can do that, to the Lions Club. 
that they would be cutting, but it would not be our mower. I would make sure that was taken care of. That was one of my questions today in staff meeting. So are they liable then for the, the operating? Yes. Okay. Because I didn't want to get back into what we had at Duval where we they used our mowers and was, we were liable for that. So we're actually buying them a new Kubota? In, for liability purposes, purposes, we are uh, transferring that whatever I haven't talked to the legal counsel about how to do that. But for liability purposes, we do not want the liability involved. Again, the only thing I can answer is in talking with uh, Dana Smith. He is suggesting this, recommends it, and believes we come out ahead on it. Uh, as far as the grass cutting. And honestly, I don't know any more to say than that, but I'm taking his recommendation. So if we get our own fields, they still keep the Kubota, and we have to buy another one to maintain our own fields? By the time probably we get our fields, uh, remember they are cutting our fields mm -hmm. at the high school. But by the time we get our field, probably, if you're speaking of the football field, yeah. that Kubota will probably be uh, worn out unless we get some a lot of cash quickly but they they are cut they will will help us out on the fields we need so it's not like they will not help us they will but it's it's there more well I, I, I want I don't want to say anything definite because one of the very important criteria that I have to get through or problems is um, liability and I can't come back with the board if I can't accomplish that then I may come back to the board what is it we pay down a year now I think 20,000 no 20,000 uh, and remember uh, if, if you ask anyone from Hamlin or anyone from the high school they deserve every penny for what they do and prepare the fields and the lines and I mean, we kind of have a first-class operation over there, and no one contributes except the board with money. But as far as, you know, how everybody else has volunteers and people work from the schools, we, we don't have that. So they do a, a huge service for those two schools. When we get a new field at the high school, there has to be a lot of uh, changes in the way the booster club operates and the principal handles that because that really falls on the boosters. Do we have a price, and I've asked Dana this before, as to what it would cost us to get new fields at the high school? It would be a pretty easy estimate uh, because uh, what ZMM has done for so long, there's kind of a basic price uh, that you for a turnkey job and then I could have them kind of back off of that because for example if volunteers built the uh, athletic facilities at the site then you could you know discount that uh, but it's quite quite expensive what's up uh, we don't have a figure in here no ma'am i did it one time uh, but i i don't man my first year i did let's let's bring that up here at the end with board comments development But that my my big concern was um, was lobbying. That's where I was coming yes. from. Yes. Um, and I will make sure I'll be back to the board. Well, I mean that's and I have to do everything legal. Of course. But that was my that was my big concern. I I, I 